All right, guys, uh, back again for another vlog episode. It's been a while since I've done one of these, and uh, hopefully I'll get to upload this one fairly soon. Right now I'm in the middle of making some hamburger awesomeness, and if you can see down here, I'm gonna burn myself. Yeah, awesomeness. These are going to be baked, I mean fried out, and I've got some butter melted so that I can make some nice little patty melts here, kind of like Frisco burgers. And I tried these the other day, they turned out awesome, and so I'm going to try these again today. Uh, let's take a look at the outside, how it's going. All of our pretty leaves are gone off of our maple, they have blown. I've got to somehow, sometime, uh, chop all those up, probably with a lawnmower. I'm not sure if I have to mow again anytime soon, but uh, if I do, I'll just chop those up and rake them over to the little compost pile. You can't really see it. It's way down yonder in that corner down there. So I just figured I'd uh, do a little vlog episode today on, you know, what's going on here lately. Uh, got a couple things coming up. Trying to um, get another guitar hangout. Uh, hopefully I'm going to try to upload this uh, vlog before that and uh, that way you'll kind of get an idea of what it's going to be about. I've got a new guitar. I'm not going to reveal it now, but it is a guitar that I've been wanting for a long time. Not the exact one I've been wanting, but it's, it turned out to be a good one, and I'm looking at it right now. And if you guys stay tuned for the Hangout on my Google Plus page, check out my Google Plus page. Um, I think I just got a new URL. If you go to plus.google.com slash the plus sign Eric Beatty, you can check that out and the google hangout will be happening um very soon it says it on there i don't like i said i'm gonna try to upload this so it's gonna it's supposed to be wednesday november the 6th so depending on when you're watching this it could have already happened i'm not sure i'm gonna try to make sure that that doesn't happen i've got some iMovie editing today to do so that will probably um i'll probably get this one in the mix first and go ahead and upload it Probably not going to be a bunch of editing, you know, all the silences in between and all that. So, right now I'm going to check my burgers, see how they're doing. Have a good mush. Squish them out real good. Staying way back here away from the, you know, the, the grease. They're looking very awesome. And I tried 57 sauce on these and I tried barbecue sauce. By the way, let me show you my favorite barbecue sauce on the planet. Has been for a while. That is Sonny's barbecue sauce. Let me go ahead and grab that. I've got some Obano peppers here, getting ready to uh, make the Sonny's sweet barbecue sauce. You can get this at Walmart now. Finally, this was is available at Walmart. It's a five-pound container it's awesome uh used to be only available at sam's club but now you can get it at walmart on the bulk sizes but anyway back to the uh the stuff that's going on i got a guitar new guitar the hangout's going to happen very soon i had some setbacks on my um video editor his computer crashed so now i'm in the process of hunting for another one on odesk um and I've contacted one other person. If they don't get back with me within the next day or so, I'm just going to write them off and find somebody else. So I've got to get this done for you guys. This bluegrass guitar course, it's uh, trying to get it done as quick as I can. Uh, I know things are getting hectic with Christmas and everything coming up. Thanksgiving. Right now, I've got my hands full editing this vlog. And um, I've got another video series coming out for the month of November. And uh, you'll probably hear about that within the next day or two. Um, I mentioned it in my pentatonic extensions video. So uh, if you want to go, you can go over there and check that out. And it's about uh, some Tony Rice. I got a uh, request on my Google, not Google, my um, guitar lesson suggestion box on YouTube to do some, um, some requests. And this one really stood out to me. It was a challenge, tr trust me. And it's by Tony Rice. Anything by Tony Rice is a challenge. And if you are man enough to do this, then uh, this series is for you. It's coming up very soon. Uh, it's based on Tony Rice's, the Rice Brothers um, 
one of their songs that they do. I don't want to reveal it just now. Just stay tuned. Every Tuesday, these guitar lessons come out, so stay tuned to watch for that. Right now, I'm going to go ahead and uh, probably try to drain. Right now, we've got to take some of these uh, grease things out <laughs> to the trash, so I'm just going to set those over here so I don't forget about them because I've got to drain some more grease off of these hamburgers, and I just keep my cans down here. I save my cans from, you know, sliced peaches or uh, mostly when I make spaghetti, I'll save the cans from that. So I have to have two hands to do this, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, turn this off and resume it when I get back. Alright, so I'm back. So what I do now is I'll take the butter pan and the toast, and I usually take and just put it on there and wipe it around real good and then flip it. That way it's buttered on both sides. Now do that with this one as well. Welcome to Eric Bay's Cooking Hour. Yeah. Anyway. So we move this one over. It's been buttered. And I could just put this one over right there. Now the oven's not on right now because I don't need these to go just yet. But I guess what I can do, since these are pretty much done, I can go ahead and flip the oven on. Put it on about medium. Now, the one thing about these grilled cheeses I have realized is that by the time you flip them to the other side, you know, you always check them when they're going to ground, ground. By the time you flip those, you need to probably lower this because by that time it's very hot and it's it's going to take a lot less time than it did originally to get brown. So you got to keep an eye on it whenever you flip it. Start watching it very heavily. But anyway, uh, pretty much that's all I got as far as like any updates or anything like that. I, like I said, I do have my hands full editing some videos and things like that. I've got some other ideas that I'd like to do. Me and my wife is tr are trying to get together maybe this week and have ourselves our very own, um, you know, every year I try to make Christmas videos and uh, uh, I'm gonna try my best to not forget about the, uh, <laughs> the stuff in there. Let's have ourselves a nice background here, shall we? Anyway, every year I try to do uh, some Christmas videos for you guys, and I've already got some things rolling around up top here. Um, but she has been practicing her piano stuff like crazy. And she's got her little piano stuff over here, some Christmas stuff she's been working on. And what I want to do is maybe do a duo. You know, she can play some chords or some melody or whatever while I play on the new guitar that I'm about to reveal. And so I was going to maybe incorporate that in some Christmas videos this year. By the time the end of the uh, Tony Rice videos happens and rolls around, it will be time to have some Christmas movies. So it's already there. I mean, it's it's hard to believe. Right now, see the way, you know, if you do YouTube um, like I do, you schedule your videos in advance and then... Um, it you know you build up a big list of videos and then you know they they release once every week or once ever however often and for me right now I've got a lot of videos built up and I'm about to upload some more and so I like to keep that stuff especially videos that are lessons anything like this that is kind of dated then I really want to be able to not upload those as much and make those as live and as current as possible it doesn't always happen sometimes but I try to do that and so for now what we're doing little break here I'm going to take these uh, burgers here and go ahead and incorporate those onto the uh, cheese here these are done look at that nice awesomeness and then we'll take this and sit to the side the oven is off and I'm just going to rinse off my spatula here but anyway, while I'm doing this, uh, I'm trying, like I said, I've got a lot of videos uploaded and uh, probably about four or five of them coming up. And so for the month of November, it's covered, you know. And so I'll probably have enough, maybe we're going to try to do two Christmas videos. Um, Melissa and I are going to try to do two videos, um, just of us together. And then... It's getting there and then after that we're going to try to uh, I'm going to try to maybe do one one or two more videos depending on how much time I have which I should have enough time if I have to release two a week then that that'll be fine too but I'm gonna to try to release two more videos maybe on my own 
maybe those will be video lessons uh, as well. I've got one in mind that uh, it's going to be a bluegrassy thing and uh, maybe incorporate some more electric guitar into that. But uh, anyway, for the first of the year, I'm not sure exactly if I have anything new coming. Uh, maybe do some more business stuff, you know, um, blog wise and what I do for the first of the year to prepare for the next year coming on. Um, uh, last year I really tried to you might be you know it was kind of a first year of me being at a business this year is my second year really and I know that uh, I know a few more things now than I did then and I've read a lot of materials read a lot of books different things like that and uh, maybe have some insights you know I've got some goal setting things I'm gonna sit down and try to work out one of the things as far as goal settings that we do have worked out is uh, just to give you an idea of what we do we have our short-term goals up here things like uh, pay off car loans you know get health insurance get me a smartphone which is already done some of these things are checked off some of them aren't um, some of them were done very soon and we have a timeline here as well and I'll go ahead and focus isn't going to work when I'm that far away we have five-year goals you know maybe uh, some other things that we have like have myself professionally five professional guitar products released and uh, this means that I have someone paid to do it you know if, that I have a team of people paid you know, like my virtual assistants right now I have a graphic designer I just lost my video editor but I do have a tablature creator as well so uh, these five products are you know whatever they're going to be they are a priority uh, i'm going to try my best to maybe if i get anything more complex maybe to uh, have him do and if i get where i can afford it have him do some youtube tabs and upload those to my websites you know uh you know different five-year goals that we have and then 10-year goals what would we like to do in 10 years you know one of my goals is to have lasik surgery um I, I, you know, I've had glasses or contacts most all of my life, and uh, it does get to be a pain, and I'd like to have LASIK surgery done so I don't have to fool with that anymore. Let's check these uh, burgers out. Okay, they're getting a little too done. Let's flip these over. Yeah, when you see that, it's a little too done. Uh, let's go ahead and ouch. Try not to kill ourselves and burn ourselves to death while we're doing this. Yeah, that's a little too much. But anyway, the other day I did this and they were golden brown. I'm talking golden. Let's turn the heat down. I've got to have, I'm going to have to watch these very closely. Um, so I'm going to stay in here while I'm talking. Go ahead and get the uh, other necessities out, like mayonnaise. The best mayonnaise in the world. Good old helmets. All right, so... And the barbecue sauce, which I'm not going to use that big thing. I actually have some uh, many squeeze bottles that I put some in before. Get that out, get a butter knife, and we'll be set to go. So while I'm in here in the kitchen, I can watch this stuff. Like I said, this won't take long at all. I'll show you an idea of uh, what we have as far as other goals. You know, more short-term goals that we've been working on. One of which was to get a new guitar, which now... I can check that off because I'm pretty sure this guitar is a keeper. I'm pretty sure I'm going to keep it. Uh, yeah, we got some burntness going on here, but it sometimes happens. Anyway, what you get for uh, vlogging and talking and everything at the same time while you're cooking. Okay, so we're going to flip these over to the better side, the side that doesn't have the cheese attached to it. And go ahead and peel that apart and put on our goodies. Barbecue sauce and mayonnaise. So anyway, uh, the other goals that I have, I can show those to you here in just a little bit. Like I said, as far as things coming up for the new year, it's it's not really, um, you know, I don't really have any ideas as far as, you know, the next product to come out. I do know that I want to start recording more uh, as far as audio stuff. The band is now, you know, uh, finally taking a little bit of a break and I can rest a little bit, so I don't want to overdo it as far as, you know, doing a lot of heavy guitar stuff. But like I said, I do have the new guitar and I do want to uh, start recording some more. I've been experimenting with GarageBand. I did it that one time and uh, 
really enjoyed it. Really was pleased with the fact that it didn't take forever and a day to do, you know, just one song. I can just basically re take all the tracks that I need. You know, it's got all those loops in GarageBand. And uh, I can basically uh, paste all that stuff in there and then just do maybe two guitar tracks, a rhythm and a lead over the top of it. Not a lot of, you know, work involved in that. So I'm really happy with that. And you know what? We just got some steak sauce the other day. Let's try one of these puppies with some steak sauce, all right? Some A1 style Walmart steak sauce. So I really do want to do some more garage band stuff. And uh, ever since I've switched over to uh, my wife's Macintosh, I haven't touched my Windows laptop at all. And uh, so I'm, I'm finding out that I can I can live without Windows, and that's a, a blessing right there. Didn't really want to put this on two burgers, but it might have to happen that way because now this one's soggy. Anyhow, I'm going to not do this while I'm filming. All right, those are flipped back on. And now, folks, we have awesome patty melts. Yay! What I would like to do after this is take you along with me, maybe, on uh, a walk, because I really need to get out of the house. As far as things that I've done today, I have got, um, I've got, uh, I've backed up all my bank statements. My CPA recently told me to back up all the bank statements, and so I've got those backed up digitally. I went and downloaded back those up. Did my financial stuff for the month. Uh, I do that twice a month. I do it once in the middle and then once at the end when everything has to be tabulated for the whole month. Make sure everything's off though, and yes. I have done that. Uh, I have uh, done some Facebook, you know, updating some stuff on Facebook and Google Plus. Announced the guitar hangout. Uh, so, I mean, I've done quite a bit of stuff. My calendar is pretty full for the day. I've still got a few more things to do, like edit this vlog now, now that this one's happening. And then maybe the Tony Rice one will happen tomorrow. As far as goals, here we go again. Now what we had at last year is our tax return list, okay? These were goals that involved uh, what we're gonna buy with our tax money, okay? We had some necessary items, some wants, and some don't really need wants, you know? <laughs> sure everybody's had that before. So you can see a lot of these are already checked off. There's a few more that we either didn't really need or we're, we're gonna get later. And we have a price goal, and sometimes what we pay for it is lower, and it shows the date. And so that's pretty cool. And maybe every year we can make one of these up and revise it, and through the years get to see, you know, our goals met. And so as our, we also have what we call our wish list. Now this is where my guitar came in. Actually, I'm not going to say anything about that. I don't know if you've seen that or not. If so, I'll edit that out because I don't want you to see what kind of guitar I got yet. <laughs> But we have my guitar down here, the list that I wanted to, of the guitar that I wanted to get. Um, we got uh, some other purchases. We haven't done any of this yet. We're working towards getting that done next. The guitar loan. We've got uh, the guitar. Martin guitar. The car loan. Uh, we're working on getting that done. We want to get a, a new car within five years, a new laptop or desktop. As I'm selling my laptop right now, I, I'd rather this be a Macintosh, another Macintosh. We're going to work towards getting Melissa a new laptop for her Mac. Because hers is just like the PowerBook G4 version that in 2005. It's old. It's not compatible with OS Mavericks or anything uh, that's come out. Different things, you know, that we wanted. Little expenses, one or two per, per paycheck. Things that we can buy right now to give give us a sense of our goal being met. So, as far as goals and everything, you know, that's what we've been working on. There is, you know, this is more like a, a update vlog. But uh, basically, you got to see what I've done today. Um, wanted to get some lunch and uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and sign off for now and uh, say thanks for watching I will be probably bringing you along here in just a few minutes uh, for a walk it's probably gonna be cold out there probably about 60 or 50 but I'll bundle up and we'll go walk and talk for a little bit all right all right I'll see you in a little while thanks all right guys here we are heading out to get ourselves a nice walk today beautiful beautiful weather outside looks like uh, clouds are out very nice walk things up a little bit all right let's 
check out these beautiful clouds up here. Look awesome. Beautiful. All right, as you can see, a lot of the wind and the storms lately have uh, got rid of a lot of the pretty, pretty trees. On my Facebook, I've been, uh, let's check this out a little bit better here. The trees are blocking the sun. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? Awesome, awesome fall day. Uh, but anyway, I've been posting some uh, pictures on Facebook of uh, some fall pictures that I've been able to get. I was really surprised there was so many of them left after the uh, big storm we had the other day. And this is how how warm it is outside right now. I'm wearing shorts. And uh, I wear shorts a lot, but anyway, other than that, right now it says it's 64 outside on my phone. I had to check my mail. I'm expecting a package. Uh, I had to order after I got my guitar, my new guitar. And uh, there's the annoying dogs next door. And it's not here. Hopefully it'll be here by tomorrow. Just fine. So we're just going to take off down this direction right here. Walking down that way. Alright, so let me wrap my little strap around my wrist here. Okay, so... Just got done each, eating uh, those two patty belts you just seen, and uh, um, had a little Halloween candy left over. And then we went and got the store, and uh, did that and watched a little bit of uh, one of my favorite shows. Uh, it's uh, not on TV anymore, but I got it from the library. Rented it. It's called uh, "Lie to Me" with Tim Roth. It's all about body language, and it, that stuff's fascinating to me. But uh, I thought, well, it's about 10 minutes till 3. I've got a lesson at 4.30. I can get a quick walk in. And it's just a beautiful day not to do that. I don't even need this uh, windbreaker. I just got it just in case the wind starts blowing. But uh, I'm telling you, the, the sky is lovely today. If you'll just look over here. You can see how that looks. But uh, anyway, I just want to get outside and uh, kind of walk around. Get some exercise, you know. I've been reading uh, a lot about, you know, personal development, and uh, one of the books that I'll have uploaded soon, if it's not already uploaded, which I'm sure it probably isn't, is a book. You know, the books that I read that you should, that I have. And one of them is a Brian Tracy book called No Excuses, and uh, it's a really good book. But uh, it's I just finished a chapter today on personal health and uh, talked about eating light meals throughout the day you know four or five meals a day no snacks in between it's something said very interesting is that uh, if you eat a meal and maybe i don't know 15 minutes later eat something else and just keep snacking or whatever then uh what happens is as part of your food is in one digestive stage then the food you just ate is in another digestive stage so we have some undigested some being digested you know two different stages there and that's what causes upset stomachs you know heartburn things like that but uh with me i know personally i've got to lose some weight i'm at a standstill right now around 310 and i've been that way for a year i mean i maintain just fine but it's i find myself over eating, eat, overeating a lot and i know i shouldn't be and if the wind is terrible now i apologize i don't have my windscreen on here but uh, I've got to get better at that. You know, I've got to get work and start losing some weight. That's going to be a, needs to be a big goal. I need to pump myself up to lose weight this year. I've been to so many homecomings, it's not even funny. Probably 10 or 12 this year. I mean, there's so many of them we've had to sing at. And as a result, I eat at every one of them. And my typical eating pattern is uh, go fill my plate up, sit down, eat, go back, pick from what I've just ate that I liked and get a little bit more of that and then if I have room maybe one or two desserts and that's still too much food did that yesterday and at another homecoming and it was uh, I don't know I didn't feel overly full but I know Thanksgiving's coming up Christmas is coming up and as a result of that <laughs> all kinds of chaos food wise could happen so I've got to start setting myself a goal you know, and for me, it's not long-term. Seems like it's gonna to have to be for me 
a step at a time one event at a time you know here comes a big dinner and what I try to tell myself is you know what if I get it to go box I'll have some of this later so don't gorge myself now or what I try to do and this hasn't worked is when I go to a restaurant order a to-go box and then put half of the meal you ordered in that to-go box and uh, that way you know that you got some for later you eat less now but it doesn't bother you to eat less because you have some of that later for me food is a I don't know it's something to be enjoyed I don't really eat for energy I eat because I like to eat and that's a that's the wrong way to look at it. I realize that and I have to switch arms because this one keeps going up and down because my hands getting tired but uh Man, it's just a beautiful day out here. Probably can't see because that's sun, but check that out. Man. So, in my area, I need to get more exercise. I need to eat. Not that I need to eat less, but I need my portions to be a lot less. And if I feel that I can eat throughout the day, then I don't feel like I'm missing out. Because another bad thing that happens with me is if you eat at homecoming or a big dinner so that's a big issue with that so um with me that i mean that's i don't like that i, I you know i'm sitting there suffering thinking well i, I kind of wanted this for supper but i can't have that now so, but anyway, I'm at the round of the corner here. Some people are watching, but that's fine. So, let's see, that's where it just came from. And uh, right there is where I'm going to next. And I don't think you can see it, but there, you know, there's a lot of brown on these trees. And up ahead, there's a lot of brown. So, uh, but anyway, that's one thing I need to work towards towards this year is a goal of losing weight and to do that I need to exercise every other day really you know every day but uh, hopefully with the more that I incorporate virtual assistance and people hiring people to help me on these various projects that I have the more time I'll have for getting outside walking enjoying things because I realize every time I'm down on myself about what I didn't get done, I realized that, you know what, I am in, I don't know what the percent is, but I'm in the top so-and-so percent of people because most people have jobs that they can't get out of. Most people do not have people working under them. Right now I've got two virtual assistants, maybe I'm working on three. Whew. Headed uphill, it's getting hard. Let me slow down a little bit. But I'm working on the third one with a video editor. I will get a fourth one soon. Hopefully with uh, for web design. To design the website for the new product. The new bluegrass product. And folks, I'm not rich, okay? I'll just tell you right now. I might have made $600 last month, okay? And I know, yes, my wife works. and uh, But that's all from extra income like other than teaching okay if i go to an event and we sing a lot we've been getting pretty good at getting paid to do events and that might lead to maybe you know 25 dollars a piece between me and the four band members that might lead to 75 recently it was a hundred dollars a piece and that just keeps to seem seems to keep going up but uh it's not like I make a lot of money and I can hire all these people, okay? Well, there's a way in you know, Odesk that you can limit the number of hours a person works. And right now, I've got it limited to 10 hours a week. That way, I don't go over budget and nothing catches me by surprise. And while one is doing something, when they got their task finished, I will hire another one and have them assigned to do something else. Right now, Number one main priority is the bluegrass videos, okay? Here's my process in this. I've already got the tabs and the promo videos done. I edited the promo videos myself. But uh, the tabs, I sent the promo videos to the tab VA. 
had the tab VA tab those out and I proofed those and went over them did the changes and when they came back to me I send them off to my graphic designer so that he can make it more professional with my logo with my image of all this new you know bluegrass guitar product stuff so once that's done those are done okay well in this whole process now the process is basically get the video editor to do the videos number one that's got to be priority that's what I'm working towards right now when the videos get done I send them directly to my tab person then my tab person and me col uh, collaborate together and when they're satisfactory I'll do a final version and send it to the graphic designer okay and uh, the graphic designer then puts all my branding on it my logo my you know the color scheme you know the website the page number my name everything and that is when the tabs are done that that way I can get the ebook done simultaneously while I'm doing the videos now after the videos are done I will then have a downloadable product available and I'm still debating on this but once that's done I may go ahead and release that first as a downloadable product I wanted to release them both at the same time but I may have to wait because after that I still have to get either myself or someone else and I may I may just say this is going so good I'm gonna pay somebody else to do this and that is to author the DVDs okay the movie files have to be turned into DVD files they have to have a menus and they have to have graphics and everything set up to work and work and uh, it takes a lot of time so I'd rather format that to somebody else who can do it me look at it proof it and say okay here's the changes and now from these changes go ahead and create the rest of the DVDs based on these changes that way you're not looking at every single video proofing everything they do it based on one template that you have already proofed for one item so I've got to get the DVDs authored then I can send them out to my DVD supplier they can create a product from it then I can release that as a DVD product hardcover or hard copy so for me that's the process okay and uh, I know this is probably in a long vlog because I said it was going to be joined with the other one and at first I thought about well you know what it's gonna be a lengthy one why don't you just go ahead and make it two different vlogs that's two videos but you know what I I said in the last video I was gonna do this and that's what I'm doing so right now we are just about to the end of the road when I get to the end of the road I will turn around and go back same way I came because I don't really like crossing that road going over and then coming back down that way but anyway it's a good day for a walk and good day for a talk with you guys I hope you've uh, learned a lot from this got a lot out of it it's good to talk you know it's good to feel like like I said this vlog is it's kind of liberating in the sense that it feels like I'm talking to you guys directly so now I've been alone all day my wife's been at work I've been doing my stuff for my business but at the same time you know it gets lonely it gets boring but guess what now I have somebody to talk to and that is you youtubers and so I thank you so much for subscribing if you like this video please click the like button below subscribe wherever the subscribe button is they change things so much you just you subscribe and that way you can get updates to when I release new videos like this and as far as my, my bluegrass guitar course goes I'm updating that on Facebook Google Plus Twitter LinkedIn mainly YouTube because that's where most of my bluegrass audience is so at least subscribe to YouTube if you don't subscribe to anything else subscribe to me on YouTube I've been doing some Google Hangouts like the one I'm about to do in a couple days and uh, if you'll go to my Google Plus page I don't know if YouTube if it, if it goes through YouTube or not if it announces it through YouTube whenever I do it I know whenever I do the uh, hangouts it's supposed to stream to both Google Plus and to YouTube so I don't know uh, right now I'm kind of dealing with hangouts maybe after that I'll do some live events 
a lot of events you can't you know really uh, get together as a group but you can you know do the chat and all that I don't know if I want to fool with that I've seen some some bad examples of that but anyway I think I'm gonna go ahead and get off here and enjoy this wonderful beautiful day and uh, listen to some audiobooks that I have on my mp3 player on the way back once again that's what it looks like I can't think of anything else is going on after I get done this walk I'm gonna go in there probably get started on the uh, video that I'm doing right now this vlog get it chopped to pieces and edited and uploaded and between that I'll be doing a video lesson for a student that's uh, that I've got and you can you can see an example of something like that coming up soon I'm pretty sure I'm going to release this video this week so right t today is Monday November the uh, I think the fourth I'm going to release that hopefully today or tomorrow my guitar hangout is Wednesday November the 6th at 12 o'clock noon CS time Central Standard and the video my, my student missed a Skype lesson one time and I went and recorded it through a webcam now the, the quality isn't that good because uh, the uh, the webcam for some reason didn't pick up just right but it is a better webcam than what the quality of this video is going to be it's a Logitech C C270 I think it's a really good webcam for some reason it just didn't pick up I went to YouTube and pressed upload and you know how you have those options there on the left hand side or the right hand side that uh, allow you to either upload or record a webcam I did that and it didn't turn out good at all so I created her a video of that but anyway I'm saying that to say this this week it's going to be this Thursday or Friday that I'm going to release that as a, a companion video to the video that's releasing on Tuesday November the 5th it's a lot of dates that's all happening this week I'm gonna get home get this thing uploaded as quick as I can so that you guys can know what's going on thank you so much for watching please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video that'll probably be Tuesday on the next lesson video and you know just I'm really enjoying doing this real-life stuff it's really liberating it's really fun it's exciting to see what's going on in my life right now and so to get my heart rate back up I'm gonna listen to my audiobook I'm listening to Jonathan Strange and Mr. Norrell one of my favorite books of all time if you haven't picked that book up check it out it's awesome I'll see you guys next time on the next video I'll leave you with this wonderful shot of a car going down the road that I'm about to walk down